please. Ms. Herzog. Wilson, please tell us where you're from. <laughs> I've been from Wilson for my entire life. Uh, Linda Herzog, East Quilcene Road in Quilcene, and representing Quilcene Conversations this morning. Uh, a few things I need to tell you about. I haven't been here for quite a long time. Everything is still happening in Quilcene, lots of activity. Uh, as you probably know, the uh, Quilcene Fair and Parade is this Saturday and part of it's Sunday. And uh, this year, the Quilcene Conversations group has been quite honored. Four of the dignitaries of the fair have been selected from among our little movement. Uh, John Helsper, the master uh, for, of our gardens and our beautiful spaces in town, is going to be the Grand Marshal. Cass Brotherton and Tom Brotherton are king and queen of the parade, and I get to be citizen of the year. Great. So we're all going to be on the same truck. Pardon me? Congratulations. Thank you. And uh, so we'll all be on the same truck. It'll say Cool Scene Conversations on one side and Count Me In for Cool Scene, our nonprofit organization, on the other side. And uh, of course, we'll be handing ch candy to the children to entice them into our movement. And uh, so do come. It's going to be a great deal of fun. The uh, second thing I'd like to tell you about is uh, we've been in this game now for almost seven months. And at the end of September, which will be seven and a half months, we are going to have our third ever all-community meeting. And we have actually accomplished just about everything we uh, wrote down for ourselves to do this summer. And we're going to select a bunch of new projects on September 30th and report on the old. Uh, I made a list last night of the things that have been accomplished because of Quilcene Conversations, and it came to about 26 items. So we're feeling pretty, pretty bullish about this. So we'll uh, get back together in those corners that we talked in and, and the first uh, meeting we had in February and see if we can pick off a few more projects and just get moving on them. One of the things I'd love to know by September 30th is uh, what's happening with the infrastructure fund. I've missed a few meetings and perhaps I have missed uh, an announcement in the newspaper, but I don't know when, uh, when we're going to get going on the opportunity to apply for infrastructure money. And what is the third thing I was going to tell you about? Uh, oh yes, the Gateway Garden. Um, it's a little bit late. I think I had told you that it would be in place and the sign would be hung by the time of the fair. But uh, we got a little bit of a late start. Uh, John Helsper's dad unfortunately passed away and he was out of commission for about a month. So uh, we're underway now and it's, uh, I do have some pictures, but my, my yellow light is on. And I'd like to let you see what it is so far. The color is horrible, but Thank you. that's where we are right now. And on September 30th, we will be hanging the sign in the Gateway Garden, and it's going to be just beautiful. It's just south of town, welcoming everybody who comes up 101 from the south. Thanks much. Thank you. <coughs> Who would like to be next?